Okay, looks like we're live again. And time to do the quick posts. Social media. Yet again. As we do every week. <laughs> right there okay that's that we do have sound I tested everything before we went on but I just want to check my voice while we're live to make sure that I can be so I can be heard okay I'm trying to get better at this whole microphone thing I gotta get used to like speaking into the mic because once you get distant it's it's really hard to hear me and talking. I have to like project a lot more. I've been listening to my footage a lot and noticing that I, I can sound mumbly and just talking a little louder helps a lot with that. All right, anyway, we are going into, I guess, the Gerudo area. Could go from here. It seems like an okay spot to come from. I could do this shrine, but we know that shrine takes forever, so I don't really want to do it. I know it's not close enough to night, and I don't think the blood moon's going to be coming this night. So I guess the second best approach would be from here to go this way. Or we just skip from the shrine and go from Satori. I don't know if we had a blood moon. We maybe you can get the uh, the one diamond grind. That's up here. That's a Tori while we're here. And then just walk our way down into Gerudo. Okay, let me close all these friggin' social media and whatnot. So I can keep everything up. Okay, keep the preview off. So my setup will be just off of the Display off of OBS. So there's a tower. Which one is that? So this is the, the super tall one. We want whatever is in here. I'm not entirely sure where that tower is. I don't even remember. It's been too long. Let's get the, uh, the diamond checked out, though. It's, like, right in front of me. I don't think it's respawned yet. Because I don't remember a blood moon happening. But always good to check for free money. <laughs> it's a good, a good way of life to be having. Nobody says no to free money. I, I thought that crow just like tried to dive bomb and attack me. That would have been incredible. Is the stone here? Yeah, there it is. Okay. No, not yet. We need a blood moon. Still got a ways to go. Okay. So, I guess we could just climb the whole mountain and try and get there that way. I don't know what the best angle is to climb this thing. But, I would like to get this tower before getting that tower. So, we're gonna, we're gonna climb it. <laughs> I think this is a Korok. Boulder doesn't look particularly close. Uh, it's all the way up there? Yeah, I'm not getting that. Too far for me. Look at all these crows. Jeez. <laughs> I still have two gales left, and there's a reasonable amount of land that we can just walk up. What's this area here? I don't remember this at all. It's like this little cave. It's in here. There's a Korok in there. Neat. Making sure I'm using the weak bow. All right, let me get this arrow. Yeah, I know you're cute. Is anybody else around here? Doesn't look like it. All right, let's get up all up on this mountain and climb our way up. Or more specifically, air draft our way up, probably, because the rain is going to make this impossible. Also going to want our little hat. Hmm. 
Okay. Good, there's sun here, so we won't we won't slide down the end. I've gotta get used to the amount of stamina that I have, so I might I might have to take this slow in order to get all the way up. So we might want to equip the hammer for the sake of any kinds of stones we might see. Looks like they're not around though. I'm thinking of like the uh, the mineral stones. Those would be pretty nice. Get some mushrooms over here. I think we can do it. Yeah, that's fine. Okay, almost there. We are in this territory. I feel like it's over here. Somewhere. I'm gonna just like put an arbitrary stamp just so I know what direction to go. I'm probably gonna need a gale for this one. We should reset the gale stamina anyway. Right. Cool. Temperature is getting pretty low. Just do some some quiet walking there. Alright. We are now officially in cold territory. Everything is super dangerous now. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I can... I can full drop this. We don't have any snow boots, so we're gonna be moving kinda slow up here. But I do generally know my way around. This is a pretty long I'm gonna have to I'm gonna have to slowly climb up this one. This is too high. Yeah, it's way too high. There's not enough uh not enough places to gain your ground. Might have to use one of my stamina foods that I've prepared as well, because I, I don't think that we'll make it. We need heart recovery? I guess not. If, the, if we eat the stamina, we're going to recover the hearts. We should be fine. We still have Mephas as well, so I don't need to really worry about being low health or anything at the moment. Man, this is going to be pretty close now. Huh? I have to jump at the end. Uh, that's pretty close. Whoop. There we go. That's a tired link. There you go. I can't do this either. I have to slow climb this as well. Why is it all green, by the way? What happened to this atmosphere that everything... Oh, that's why. Okay. Everything is green because the moon is red. <laughs> I do not believe we fall off if the moon were to become a blood moon at this exact moment. Might be wrong though. Alright, we are officially in the snow. Alright, give me my my snow call and my home. Get that crap away from me. It's actually weaker than this freaking hoe. <laughs> kind of surprising. Okay. Hello, wolf. We have the power to bombs now, so I don't have to worry about these guys at all. I would like a shrine, actually. This took a really long time to get to. It's another rush room. Oh, wow. We're still going, huh? Okay. I regained a reasonable amount of stamina. I need to put back on the other guy. So the shrine is near here. It might be the one that we have to to burn open. I remember that one being up here. The one that's entrapped inside ice. I have flint and I have wood. So I guess we can go about it that way. Oh here comes the here comes the blood moon. It's coming. Here it comes. Music's like I'm getting closer now. Maybe we can see it. There it is. It's gonna get really big really fast. 
Actually, this means that the diamond respawn, but we could get that later. That's not that big a deal. Can do that when we like go after Satori or something. Where is this this thing? Is this this way? Around this? On top of this, kind of. That way. Oh, there's a our friendly neighborhood dragon over there. We're probably not going to be able to get him. I could shield surf this and go by a little bit faster and safer. I'd say this is worth. Yeah, it's this one. Okay, I don't want that one. That one's scary. Where are we going then? Just down here? I still don't see where the tower is. There is, um, this is like an enemy spot, I remember. I don't know if we can just walk in this way. No, I, no, you can't walk in this way. This is for like a boss encounter, but we can only go in once we've actually entered from the front. Also, it's raining. That's pretty bad. Okay, well now it's sunny, so I can't decide what weather we are right now. <laughs> kind of strange. And there's the way in. How do we get around this? I guess we have to wait for the gale to come around for us to get up through this. I don't see any other way past it. Should equip. Oh, I hear, <laughs> I hear a dragon. Where is he? It's like right above me. You can't just give me this music and tease me. Where is he? Is he like below me? Oh, there he is. Okay. Alright, I already got one. I didn't think I had that. I guess I don't have Dinral at the moment. Rivali's there we go. Alright. Let's go up to the one we were at. And then use Gale to get up. I don't think we're going to be able to get the tower for this area at this time. I think we're already yeah we're already in the other area it's somewhere over there i didn't see any like evidence of it at all while we were there i just hope we can find a shrine or something just in case we die <laughs> oh i guess we we can unmark that now there's nothing here and this is I want an any spot. I don't remember what's on top of this. Nothing? Okay. <laughs> and then there's the way in. Okay. Yeah. This might be... I know the Yiga clan is here. There's, there's the entrance, I guess. Okay. So this spot... We need to know. More Skeleton. You monsters. <laughs> Get away from me. <laughs> Just casually walk up to them. There we go. Okay. I don't think we need the bow, but we do have one of equal strength, right? Alright. That's fine. 
it's not a lightning kind of situation here until we actually get to the main encounter. Where's our tower? It's over that way. It's the red one, right? Yeah, we still are quite a ways away. We still haven't gotten any shrine indicators either. So we're probably gonna have to navigate through the desert a bit. Oh, there. Yeah, it's an active shrine. That's one we already got, I think. Yes, no? What is this? What am I looking at right now? I don't know. This looks like a shrine we already have, but it clearly is not. What the heck? They just run. <laughs> like, I'm not dealing with that. He has the high ground, and I know what happens to Anakin. <laughs> okay. Yeah, this is not active. Did you just run? You should know better. Also, we inadvertently killed a man. How could you? This poor rock man. He, he's like, I don't even know what to do right now. How do you expect me to fight him like this? I don't know, Rockman. I don't know how they expected you to actually kill me. I think this is definitely one of the probably lamer enemies in the game. It's like, I will walk slowly towards you and defeat you. I think this is actually a bombable spot or something. Yeah, okay. Um, How does this work? Do we like... I need to push it out the other way, right? Okay, well, we can move the one. There's like, there's rocks all through here. There's looks like there's one on the other end, too. Maybe I can just push this one in. Oh, well, goodbye, hell. Yep. <laughs> Wish we had a flatter weapon. Let's go, Leaf. Okay. Wow, it didn't even move. <laughs> Disaster. Maybe this little crack will be enough? Yeah. Okay, we got it. What's in here? Look at all this stuff. Holy crap. This is incredible. Take all these pictures. Jeez. I have no idea about this spot. Gerudo Spear. Someone just, like, lived here? Alpha's full. Alright. Get rid of all this stuff. Now we don't need... Pretty sure we don't need dragon. If we do need dragon, we can just get another one. It's no big deal. I don't want to get rid of any of the ancient stuff because I'm not sure what quest line may or may not go with that. All right, so we just got the spear. Neat. Edge of duality. Well, we golden bow. I believe these bows actually suck, <laughs> from what I remember. Yeah, those, those bows actually suck. What's the least... Eh, I'll, I'll take it because it's fancy. That's the only reason why. And this edge of duality is definitely worth taking probably over the spear. Eh, well, I, I could get rid of the stuff chamber. That's fine. A little scimitar here. Oh, that's pretty good. 25, huh? Well, that's better than the spear. What else you got? Oh, cool. cool. I could probably get rid of the leaf. I think the leaf is unnecessary. Bomb arrows. Man, we freaking struck rich here. So much good stuff. Okay. Is there anything else here? I think that's it. Did we did we actually get trapped? No. Okay. That would have been incredible if it's like the rock closes behind you. You cannot leave. <laughs> All scripted event. Why is this rock even here? Okay. That is very strange. This must be the tower for here. 
So this is the tall tower then. We have enough air time. I see our divine beast over there. It's Cass, but we gotta activate first. So that must be a different tower. Does it go dun 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 at the end? I guess. Yeah, it does, it does, it does. Okay. It's actually the item gets sound. I don't know why I didn't put that together when I actually heard it for the first time. <laughs> hey, guess. What's up? Yes, please. Oh. I can already tell you I'm going to need to go to the bathroom after this. <laughs> I'll go as quickly as I can. We'll do it while cast plays. Do your thing. Alright, cool. Just put some text. For people who are watching the VOD, when the text is gone, I'll be back. Okay, bathroom, BOB, please get bigger. Thank you. Okay. When this text is gone, I will be back. See you then.
All right, we are back. All right, let's go. So there is a shrine quest here, but we are going to ignore it. And instead, gotta mark this, because that's an important landmark. We kind of want to get the tower here. I think I'll go for the shrines first. First shrine we can get to. I know we need to cough up some cash for some clothes for this quest line. God, how do we even get over there first? I guess from here, yeah. Maybe I'll warp to get to that after we get the quest line over here started. Where's the oasis? Is that it? Yeah, it looks like it. We'll go over there first. We might not have enough stamina to be able to do that. Try nearby. Below me? Guess we're about to find out. Alright. Temperature is high, but not very high. And our map is gone. Okay, well I hope it got good enough surroundings. Because we are doing this blind now. My tracker is gone too. Gotta figure out a way to cool ourselves off if we got into the desert heat. All of our sensors are jammed, huh? Our sense of direction is gone. I think I see something this way. <laughs> now we're hot. Do I have anything for this? I don't think I do. I know I could make something, though. There's got to be some way to make something. Here, let's... Well, there's no pot, is the thing. Gosh, ugh. Maybe we could wait till nightfall. I could force it to be nightfall. Okay, we made it in shade. We don't have any ice rods to lower our temperature either. What if I took my shirt and clothes off? Would that help? No. Just curious. We gotta, we gotta start a fire and then sleep to get it to be night where it's cold. And we'll have to traverse through the cold. Where is my wood? Oh, I gave all my wood away. Uh, that sucks. How much time is it till night? It's actually pretty long from now. I guess we're gonna have to wander through here for a bit then. I know there was a shrine. If we can get in the shrine, we'll at least be a bit safer. So these things typically go. There. Still can't really see. I think we have to go higher. At least on top. Doesn't really get us where we need. I know there's a shrine around here somewhere. Let's see if we can see it through the sand. But now we're hot too. Ugh. We're too high up. Heart's going down. Pain rising. It's good. Alright, we're just going blindly in. What is this? That's a 
That's a bad time is what that looks like. I'm still hot, huh? That's the opposite of what we want right now. I could shield surf my way a bit. Looks like the temperature is pretty mixed in this spot. We're fine, but I'm like slightly over in any direction. We could go off. Really nice if this sandstorm were to stop at any point, <laughs> so I could see. Huck. Oh, shrine! Whoa! There goes everything. And there's Elizabeth. the gold though. I guess we did use it once. Yeah. Okay. Can I equip the ice arrow and reduce my temperature? Doesn't look like it. Alright, well at least now we can see where we are. Can I see the shrine from here? Rivali's Gale is now Not ready. really. I think we're kind of sunk if we go in there. So we gotta figure out a, oh there goes the sun. We gotta figure out a way to navigate our way through the shade to the oasis over there. Guess that's what we're doing. From shade to shade. Okay. It's like a, like almost like the floor is lava kind of. It's kinda cool. When I first traversed this, it was nighttime for me, so I didn't have this problem. <laughs> okay. Alright, we made it here. Looks like if I go that way, it's gonna be all sun. I could make that, maybe. Keep on going around to try and make our way as close as possible before we attempt to just run through willy nilly. Some wolves. Sure. Are they actually gonna do something? Yeah, there you come. Oh, it's a cloud. It's a cloud. I want this. Give me a cloud. You gotta chase the cloud. Let's go. No! The cloud is gone. Alright, well, we're, we're booking it now. see civilization I run towards it <laughs> I think we'll make it that's a shrine yeah I know <laughs> I don't really want to use any items on this that aren't heat specific oh my god the HP it just goes. It goes forever. Okay. Almost. All right. If this challenge is easy enough, we'll just be able to restore our, all of our hearts on this anyway. So it shouldn't matter. We made it <laughs> without even going to the rest stop. We will need to at least get some mitigation or better timing for when we go through this again. 
whole picture. Well, this is clearly an electric kind of dungeon. You need to connect the electricity to these things. And we have metal objects lying around. I guess we're using magnesis. Not all of these are mandatory, but I would like all of them, of course, so... Okay. Where does this put us? It's like one away. That doesn't quite work now, does it? We need better spacing than that. Is there another cube? Yes, there is another cube. So you want to go to the right first. And then we can get this stuff. Why doesn't this go off? There we go. We got one. Where does this go? That's a really big spot. I think we need the cube for that. Come on, buddy. Feels like it isn't on, right? I don't know. And we need the, the barrel wherever that is right now. I'm not quite sure where I put it. There it is. Need to put that over here. Where are the other barrels though? Is there no other barrel? Need a lot more than just this. Where are the other metal objects in this room? Is there anything on the ceiling? I guess there's the chests too. One of these chests is metal. Both of these chests are metal, so they're still considered the same kind of thing. Maybe we get the chest activated instead of the, the cube then. Which of these is the easiest to activate? The reasonable surface area. Is there a short distance anywhere here? There's this. You could get that with the cube. Okay, I would not not with the cube, with the uh the barrel. So we take the barrel. Move the barrel over to this spot. That gets us up there. That puts us from here to here. Which we can then move to there. That's not the right one. This is the right one. Okay, that goes to there. Alright, now we got a cube. Okay. Sick. That gets one of them. We need the chest, but this. What can this do? This gets us here. Which means we can put this here. Which means we can put the cube here, which gets us the next door. Okay. Ouch. I was afraid that would happen. We're gonna die that once. I, I freaking... I swear it. <laughs> Hey Minecraft, I see you. I'm pretty good. The end of yet another week of work. Oh, Thunderblade, that's pretty sick. I don't think we have anything that good. 
Nice. Um, I guess I'd rather have that than this. Uh, yeah. The end of a work week. Feels good. Hopefully for this weekend, the plans that I have will come to fruition. Um, planning to try and Skype, Skype with friends to play Phoenix Wright. Um, I've been trying to do it for like, for months and we've been postponing it because people have been busy. But this looks like it'll be the first weekend that they aren't busy. So I'm happy about that. You're really good at Overwatch. Did you did you watch the whole thing? I posted the one video. There's like one from uh, from yesterday, or were you there the whole time? Okay, you, yeah, you saw the video. It was fun. I'm only uh, I'm only plat diamond, so I'm not like the best in the world or anything like that. But I can I can hold my own at least a little bit. <laughs> All right, now I think I'm lost. Oh no, we we have the chest, don't we? Yeah, we have the chest though. Okay, missing a small piece. So we need the cube for the space here. That has to go here because that space is way too big otherwise. So that means the chest needs to electrify something smaller like that. Which gets us everything. That's not quite right space. There you go. Da, 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 da. This isn't active for some reason. There you go. And then that goes there and there and there. All right, cool. Now I need one more <laughs> to get to this one. This cube goes here clearly. But I also need to get to here. Oh, you just need a second cube. That's easy. That's easy peasy. Get that cube over here. Sick. Hey. Why aren't you at? What you doing? <laughs> just barely off. There you go. Better? No? Stick. Sweet. Now I can recover my hearts. <laughs> All of that to recover hearts for free. Yeah, I always talk no matter what. Because you never know when anybody's going to be watching a VOD or going to be watching a highlight vid. So I'll talk, I'll talk regardless. Maybe not as much in depth. Like I know with uh, with an audience member, it's definitely a lot easier because you have you have some kind of question to go off of. But I can at least like talk about the game or just like general things if it's uh, if it's possible. But like with with the Overwatch stream yesterday, I would concentrate on the game a lot more. But if somebody were to ask questions, I would probably be talking a lot more than I was on that particular stream. Because I'd be answering questions and shot calling at the same time, which is hard, by the way. <laughs> I don't have much experience in doing that, but that'd be that'd be hard to do. All right, it's nighttime, so I guess we don't need to worry about getting burned to death. What do you got? Are you spying? I'm a merchant. Are you spying? <laughs> Research. Yeah. So they won't let you in unless you get the man who looks like a woman. This guy, right? Hello. No, it's not that guy. It's the guy who is in this village. Yeah, that's right. Because I said hi, you didn't talk or read the message. Yeah, um, sometimes I won't see it right away because I'll be concentrating on the game. Um, but I, I do, I do try and keep a lookout. It's just 
obviously like with the crowd numbers being so low, it can be hard for me to notice sometimes if I'm thinking that there's nobody there. But I do check because the, the chat is literally right in front of me. So as long as there's like a spot of breathing room, it will be easy to see at some point. I always have chat on stream. Oh, it's Lisbos. Goodbye. <laughs> The bomb spam is real. Now we have our upgraded strength and level. I believe that is this one. So this is better than that. Yeah. Um, now we have upgraded bombs. We can just kind of hard spam every skeleton we see, which is pretty cheesy, but <laughs> it's gotta get done. There's the tower that we need up there. Oh, no, this one. Oh, no. My health. It's deteriorating. Can't believe that's three hearts that hurts. I guess this, this set of armor is pretty bad, though. Should talk to these people. So they're not who we're looking for. I don't think we have to trigger it in any way. I'm pretty sure you just go to the village and he's just on top of that, that place right there. That's at least what I remember. I'm just going to speed this up a bit. <laughs> oh. That's weird. I didn't think you would get this trigger all the way over here. Well, now we get to see our final encounter with camel sama <laughs> this is by far i would say the most consistently good dungeon as far as like playthroughs that i've seen most people like this dungeon because it's difficult and it's fair <laughs> so it's just a good a good challenge through and through the only thing I would say is that the boss for that dungeon is freaking hard. <laughs> so I'm probably going to die a lot once I get into that. Even with all the preparation that I, I could have beforehand, that boss is pretty dang hard. It's the only one that requires like actual reaction time. It wields like an electric sword and whatnot. Uh, hi, lady. Savasar. You're my dream girl. <laughs> ah, I didn't mean to say the same thing. The other one. Just the guy taking a walk. Gosh dang it, lady. <laughs> you won't approve weaver thing that I say. Alright, so we need to go on top of this and he should be there. Oh, hey, Beetle. Gimme. Gimme those arrows. Wow. There we go. Kinda of where they can just climb up that completely flat surface like that, but I guess Link is super strong and nothing matters. There's our man. You're not a lady. Study her face. We'll be upfront about it. <laughs> Oh, we, ha we, ha we actually have to play coy. You're beautiful. Yeah, we have to play coy. 600 rupees. Alright, we gotta go sell stuff to Beetle. I should have enough. I thought it was like 100 rupees. It's crazy. <laughs> hey, Beetle, wake up. <laughs> I feel sorry for Beetle. 
just oh. like suddenly having a customer and they're just be like, oh, uh-huh. Scared me. And all my sleep is gone. 15, 20 of these, 200 for us. So I need another little bit of change here. I could do like seven and then like 21 of the teeth. That seems fair. All right, that'll do it. Give me my clothes. So we have to do the same responses. Take. Sick. All right, now we can enter the village. so cute. <laughs> the freaking blushing. How many viewers would you like to reach in the future? Uh, I mean, there's not really any particular amount. I think I would just like to be able to get enough to maintain some kind of like steady viewership to have some kind of interaction from stream to stream. But it's not like I don't need anything like super huge. If I were to go for full time, though, I would need at least a reasonable amount, like most people can get around with something like 50 to 100. But um, anything like like anything like anything a big time streamer does, like 2,000 or whatever, that'd be like a lot. <laughs> I don't know how I'd like that. Oh, now we know. He's got the, he's got the shave. <laughs> you saw nothing. Alright, so now we can get in. I guess we'll just go in now. Yeah, we have to we have to trigger the quest anyway. So we'll get in, trigger the quest, and then we will try and get the tower. And I think we can get it off of the Great Plateau. That should be okay. But yeah, something reasonable but not overbearing, I guess. Don't really want to become like a big streamer, and nah, I don't. I don't really see the need to be a big streamer all that much. I I just feel the need to, well, not the need. I would like to be a sust sustainable streamer. Like money is is not why I would go for. It. Oh, they just don't even talk to you. Okay, sick. <laughs> all right. Hello. You're not a lady. How'd you get in here? <laughs> This is against the rules. I feel ridiculed and punished. What are you talking about? Oh, this is the, the journal lady. Yeah. Shock. Oh my god. I wish I could have seen Link's face, but I'm not going to go through that dialogue again. We just walk in. Yet another traveler. How did you get in here? So would you like to be a streamer all your life or not? Seems I feel like, interesting there. at the very least, I'd like it to be a good chunk of my life. I mean, you would have to think about, like, all right, when I'm, like, 60 or 70, oh. <laughs> you probably not want to be a streamer, like, full-time, because you're old and you're going to be tired a lot of the time. But um, at least for a good chunk oh. would be fun. 
I actually, I, I, I thought about that a little bit. I looked on like YouTube to see like who the oldest people who are currently in this sort of business are. There's some pretty old people in there. There's like one guy who uh, like makes, makes toys and stuff and does tutorial videos on that sort of thing. And he's like around his, his like 60s or 70s or so. And he's really good. Like he, he knows what he's doing. So it's not like you can't do it when you get old, but it's just something to consider, like how much stamina you're going to have in the long run. You're involved, I figured it out. <laughs> You've seen through my clever ruse. This is basically just boiling down to we have to go into the uh, into the Yiga plan place to get the Thunderhelm. Yeah, Thunderhelm, Family or Hood, stolen from us. They know it, we're the champion. Steal it. Seek the captain, ask for pull court. Okay. <laughs> gimme, gimme. Are you the main? Arta. Oh, she's just gone. <laughs> Is there really no one? Are you not the leader? Okay, they're the leader. They just don't. Okay, that's fine. See you, Minecraft Nova. Glad you stopped by. <laughs> oh. Oh. Uh. Okay, so now they'll talk to us. Gimme, gimme. Oh, this is just like actual information. Where's the hideout? Is it, there's no like quest. After speaking, do, 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 do. Gather definition and then head. I mean, I can just like talk to them and then be on my way. It doesn't seem. See? Um, about the thieves? Yeah, I know who they are. That's fine. And these guys are just training. Put your back into it. Now that we have gotten through activating the quest, I would like to get this tower. So I think the best way for us to get there is going to be from here. So we're going to warp our way over and get ourselves that tower activated. That way we have at least the map that we're going through while we traverse our way back to where we were. And then, once we get the Yiga clan beaten, then we'll get the Divine Beast activated. I don't know whether I'm going to get it, like, actually beaten this screen, because that Divine Beast is pretty long and the boss is actually quite hard. Oh, no, you don't. I have the power to beat the cold. Thank you. Alright, so we want to go towards the red, which is that. Okay. Well, there's a shrine right there, so I guess we could start with that. And then we can climb our way up afterwards. I don't think there's any stables near here, right? I don't remember there being any. Nah. If there is a stable, it's like after this, so there's no point in looking for any kind of horse path or anything like that. Yeah, a shrine nearby. I wonder where it is. <laughs> hmm, I can't see it. Where is the shrine? Crazy, I don't know. <laughs> Does this one require activation? Well, no, this one's fine. You can just walk in. I remember there being one that you had to, like, do something specific to open around here. Something with luminous stones? But I think that was a different spot. Alright. Let's get this shrine. We have another three shrines before we can attempt the Master Sword again. I might want the Master Sword before I go into the um, Divine Beast anyway. On the move. Well, that's one way to stop being on the move. Where are we going? What's the goal here? So we stop 
the movement and then we hit it in there that is that is the goal we don't want ice right. do we want to the, how does this work it's just like stop the ball from moving yeah all right i was thinking that the momentum would be too much but it looks like it's fine we good all right what else we got we've got <laughs> we've got enemies on the move and a ball. Let's see. That should be fine. You can't harm me from here, you silly goose. <laughs> Just casually walking, dodging lasers. You know, lasers move pretty fast, Link. You should be more concerned for your safety. Alright, here is stage three. We have the ball, okay. And there's a chest. I guess we can just take the chest? Is, is, that, is that okay? Is, this is way too fast. This is way too fast. Holy crap. Oh, there goes the ball. There it goes. Oh, well. we can at least figure out what's going on with this chest situation. So it falls up and then comes back. Is that is that what's going on? Alright. Fine. Give me my ball. There is a rest stop. Hmm. We want to be able to walk past the laser once the blocks go by. There's a second set that's pretty big. So I'm going to want to stop this one. And then walk. Oh, the blocks are still coming. I could probably still do it, even with the uh, stasis not being there. Yeah, it's fine. Alright, so we got past stage one. Now we need to get past stage two with stasis in some way. I can stop the ball. And then we can go once the block has gotten into the way of the laser. In order to magnesis, I think I'd, I'd rather put the block on first before I do that rather focused on completing and this is the widest block right so we just wait until the little block goes and then stasis oh wait what the heck how's this yeah it doesn't work how does this work oh we can stasis that that's freaking weird okay now we gotta go to get the ball again Okay, third time's the turn. I'll just walk when the actual block stops it. There we go. Easy enough. Alright, so now we, we have to stasis this so that then we can walk and there goes. It hurts. It hurts. Oh, the backtracking. No. I deserve it. It's fine. It's all me. I'm pretty sure we wouldn't make that, so we wait for the next block. Next block incoming. Next block incoming soon. There we go. Alright. There you go. Now we stasis. We pick up the ball. We walk. Not off the edge, but past the laser, and then we wait for a couple of seconds. Probably until the big block comes. There we go. Okay. And now we put the block inside the thing. And we're done. Except we need the chest. I think we could just wait at the sun for the chest. Pretty sure the reach is long enough. Yeah, this is fine. No. No. Maybe we could stasis a block once it once it's like close. Or we could stasis the conveyor. So we don't have to move at the same time we do that. We just gotta wait for the chest to come back. There it is. 
Yeah, the block's going to take too long, so we got to wait for it to be on the conveyor. We stasis the conveyor, and then we magnesis the chest. Don't you freaking... There you go. Okay. Oh, that is not what I wanted. Alright, got it. <laughs> All that for an opal. Is there anything in here? Do I earn anything else? Nope, that, that's it. Nothing behind. I've only done that like one time, but I still check every time. <laughs> I guess not every time, but I've, I've checked that spot a lot because I am a inquisitive man. Okay, so that's our next spirit orb. That puts us at two of four. Okay. So we need to go towards our red, right? Yeah. Looks like there's a means of going across up top. Rather than make it all the way to the end. Let's just fly a bit. <laughs> this is a bit faster. And hey, we even got a cork out of it. Can I reach it? Or do I have to mangle this more? Hey, there we go. Give it to me. Now where are we going? Oh, looks like we're going right here. Get in there. Get in there! No, 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 no. You? Here. There you go. a reasonably long distance. How high up can we go? I guess there's a ladder. So I guess we'll we'll, we'll take the combat route. Just gotta re situate myself above all this. So we can walk. And before I run out of stamina and look like a silly man. Nope, nope, we're good. We're good. Okay, we coordinate over top of it. We hope to not get too close to the hole and there we go all right so now we just walk our way up and still climb this is better <laughs> head itch my ear <laughs> yep there's a ladder Yoink. hey what's this ladder you're supposed to work is it only this way? Later. Link knows more about ladders than I do, apparently. Apparently, this is a one-way ladder. Is it impossible? I guess it's more safe to go off the the ledge that goes inward, right? If we're if we're talking ladder design, but wait, doesn't this like? completely dis yeah this isn't this is inconsistent game logic right there because then this is a ladder with the wood on the front of the ladder whereas this is a ladder with the wood on the back of the ladder so what's up with that game how does this even work oh it actually is consistent okay <laughs> i guess i'm the dumb one. <laughs> oh well this is awkward Hello. Goodbye. <laughs> Anyone else here? That's it. Oh, no. We got a fire rod. Do I have a fire weapon right now? I don't think we do. No, we do. Okay. So that's not worth it. If it were an ice rod, I would have gone for it. But 
Okay, so here is a tower. I feel like this is just gonna end badly. And I'm not talking about the wolf, I'm talking about the high ground here, right? I feel like we're just gonna like get bombarded by like falling rocks or something as we go up here. Guess we're gonna find out. <laughs> Okay. This was not as treacherous of all climb up as I thought it was going to be. It's apparently enough flat ground for me to just walk it. <coughs> Sneeze. Um. Yeah, that was pretty easy. Okay. Not that bad. Where is our tower? Right there. Okay. Still doing it. Still going towards the tower. Almost there. You better not be a talus. Okay. <laughs> Hello, wolf. What are you doing here? Get on that face. Leave me and my family alone. There's another one. There's a interesting Korok spot. Let's just mark that. Uh, this looks like a good time to use this. You. Though, to be fair, I do not actually know if there's anything blocking my way up here. So that might have been a huge mistake. But it gets us there faster, and we have to solve the puzzle instead of just skipping it all. So I guess it's it's better for everybody. It's better for entertainment. Are we on fire? No, we're not. It's just, we're high. High up. Okay, we just have a very weak puzzle here. Of Why don't we just cryostasis it, dummy? <laughs> Or is it because it's too dang high? It might be. Well, that's easy enough. We just go around this side, right? Yeah. I don't want to get rid of that. I got some, like, some cute little... Like, you could use Magnesis. Or I could use Cryostasis and then just do it like this. Ain't that just way easier? I think it is. <laughs> I think this is the optimal way to do it. Uh, yeah, it doesn't look like we really need the Magnesis to get across this, so I think we just keep our way keeping on. Uh, Alright. Yeah, I can just leave that. That's an easy PC leap. What we got here? More leaping? More leaping. Do we have another one? Oh, it's gonna be close. Ah, we still got it. <laughs> this little section of stamina that we have seems to be perfect for everything. <laughs> if we had more stamina, it might even be excessive. I mean, it lets you run a little longer, but like... Unless you're climbing up a very long distance, it's rare that you're going to need that much stamina. Or you're taming exactly like the big horse. You need, I think you need two wheels of stamina for the big horse. I can't quite remember. And you can't tame um, Satori, the Lord of the Mountain, with your normal stamina gauge. You have to get added stamina anyway. So you may as well just use endura shrooms or whatever to do that and we'll reset your entire gauge and give you more once you get low enough okay so now i got the map neat is there any easy shrines we can get from here I guess it'd be from this way it's because this is the way we want to go shrine lookout time I don't see anything. I'll glide. But if I don't see anything... The next... Well, I guess if I don't see anything on the way down, then... I'm just gonna assume it's not possible. Oh, this freaking puzzle. This is a shrine right here. 
God, this one's hard. There's, well, it's, it's not hard. It's it's tedious. Because there's just a bunch of things you need to find to activate it. I can do it. It would definitely mean we aren't going to be able to do the Divine Beast, though. And I don't want to do that one because it's so tedious. So since it looks like we're not going to get any shrines, we may as well just warp to the tower and just get on our way. That meter warp. What was the point of the jump then? I guess this is a scout. I don't know. <laughs> hey, there's Cassie still here. Hello. Alright, so we need to get here. Oh, they, they even have the mark already there. That's like spoilers, dude. Why? <laughs> you need to scout that stuff out. That's no fun. I ended up running to that uh, completely by mistake on my first run. I actually kind of entered the same way I did for this run, where I came in through uh, the Gerudo Highlands in through here, and then I saw this on the way in. Um, it's just when I first entered on this on my first run, I entered from here to here instead of from here to here. Not too different, but you know. There's some different sites that we saw that time that definitely disoriented me on the way up. <laughs> like running into the Frozen Shrine, that's definitely not something I saw the first time. I was thinking about like throwing a bomb on that dog just because I really wanted to kill him, but I decided not to because I'm humane, I guess. Late at night, yeah, we're gonna want the cold gear. I was like, do I want to switch to my Zora gear for more armor? Not yet. Not until we are inside the Grudal land itself. Or the Yiga land, I guess. We're gonna need to climb our way back up to where we were. We'll have Gale by the time that's relevant, I think. Okay, looks like we can just walk up this way and be fine. Rather than, than dropping, <laughs> losing all that height. Yeah, this is way better. Oh, hey, look. It's our friendly neighborhood dragon again. I don't think we'll be able to catch him. We definitely won't be able to if he doesn't come over top. I think he's just going to go over that way. Can at least enjoy his presence. Look at him as he majestically wiggles across the sky. Does it make sense? Probably not. But, you know, it's... Insensibility with, I guess, Chinese lore? Is it Chinese or Japanese that are the ones that have the long dragons that just kind of wiggle? I remember it being Chinese, but those ones were more lion like from what I, from what I can remember from like book images and stuff. Anyway, there he goes, off doing his own thing. And here we are. have to do a little climbing, but... Wow, that temperature has just freaking dropped. Holy crap. <laughs> I was like, oh, we noticed that you are now no longer in the sun. Here, have 25 less degrees. <laughs> well, and there we go. Wow, that, that was awfully generous of him to let me take up the sailcloth. I guess you can just fall from any height, regardless of your stamina, though. Seems kind of weird. I'm totally, like, not even 100% respecting this guy. I know that's, like, bad for him, but, you know. <laughs> I'm a man who lives on the edge. <laughs> There's the girl. We don't even need it, though. We're already here. I'm gonna be facing some Yigas. They have... I don't remember if they have 100 or 50. I could, like, scout. I think they just have 50, so the Edge of Duality just straight up kills them. We have two of them, though, right? Yeah, I got two. All right, so we'll use the one that's been in use, and then we'll one-shot every one we see. Here he is. 
Come back here, you. Slowly walk. There we go. Ow. You can't do that to me. You can't just kite me all game. <laughs> Wish you could farm arrows off these guys. Be nice. Oh, it's not it's not full HP, it's not worth it. Okay. Um that looked like it was somewhere around 80 HP. So I think we'll go. I'm gonna try the sword and see if that's enough. Oh, that's actually pretty good. I would like that, thank you. It's essentially the same strength as 28. So it's better than most bows we have. Let's drop this one, I guess. We'll probably run into another one on the way up. I suspect there'll be a few. No? I thought we'd get ambushed at least a second time. There, okay. Yeah, that's more like it. <laughs> I don't really know if I want to go for attack buff. I think we could just bomb them. Whoa, my god. Okay. This has gotten out of hand. I think I actually hit a Yiga by accident. <laughs> yeah. I only got one. It's worth, I guess. Skeletons are almost dealt with. We actually we keep on missing this guy. It's kind of annoying. We, we actually just killed one. <laughs> Alright, skeletons are dealt with. That is not worth it. Kite him. Alright, looks like it is about two shots of that. I'm not entirely sure. He barely moves. You're still dead, buddy. Get out of here. Alright, duplex is definitely worth trading in for any of these. So I'll take them all. Look at that writhing arm. <laughs> uh, that's three shots. This is pretty used. We're using that all of the run up against the Divine Beast last time. Do I want to heal? I guess we'll need to use it for a last encounter anyway, so I'll heal. I could use Mipha though. Isn't it one shot? Don't they just send you back? I can't quite remember. We'll do BM for a little while longer. Hello! It's Kibetz? Kibetz? Nice to join the stream. We have a torch. I believe the torch is for opening these. But we could just use the the club. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Bam. It's a chest. Okay. Not bad. All right. Yeah, I, I, don't, I don't think we need the middle altar that much. Except what's this? This is another duplex bow? I guess we'll just switch. It's definitely better than any of these. <laughs> My entire inventory is just going to be all duplex bow all the time. <laughs> Alright, here's the next one. What you got? You got another ambush? Kind of. Not super exciting. Is there any way to decipher which is the right way in this? Three, 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 a four. They have blind eyes. I don't think so. That looks about the same to me. It's probably a bit overkill to use the 45 damage weapon on the 1 HP bat, but... <laughs> 
gotta use what's in hand in that case. One of these is gonna be right. Okay. I wish I could read that. I know uh, most cases when a game developer will put an ancient language up top, there is at least some kind of bare bones translation. I know they have an alphabet for this game too. It was uh, discovered at least for like the ones that are on the trailers that like seep outside of the like when when they goop you and they give you stuff through the slate that's actually a language i don't remember what it says though you could definitely look it up i think it's something like an easter egg for the most part though. <laughs> just clave through all three I wonder if they uh, if they do durability based off of effort. Like I remember these definitely breaking a lot faster than this one currently has. It's not a durability, right? Nah, it's a normal one. I think we should definitely heal now. Heal it. Okay. So I think maybe if you go against a lower effort enemy, they'll let you keep the durability for longer. Alright, well that's just telling me that I can use bananas to change their path, which is fine. So this is definitely one of the hardest parts in the game, like by far. This this stumped me for like a good few attempts from what I remember. This is the way I came in, this is the stairs I came down, this guy's just here. I could try killing them, but they have a bunch of HP. I think we might even be able to scout how much HP they have. 600, yeah that's a lot. We should also probably put that on. Okay. 600 HP. Yeah, there's no way. Okay. So, we gotta do this the stealthy way. We can stasis them, since we upgraded it. We can use third-person camera to kind of scout them, too. Looks like he's going around the other way. Okay, yeah, we're good. Oh, that's awkward. I think we have to use a bomb. That's round one. <laughs> I'm be quiet too. I'm like in character. It's kind of kind of funny. Like sneaking stealthily, I'm like keeping my voice down. <laughs> I believe there's a way to circumvent this whole thing. Oh, look at all those bananas! Heck yeah, give me that. Also, we should save. By the way, we cannot save right now. Bamboozled. No save states. Game designers, why? I want to cheat. Cheat the system. This looks nice. Topaz. Okay. It probably has a good save. Load. Okay, yeah. It, that's good enough. It went up when I went up the stairs. I just wanted to make sure we didn't like lose a bunch of progress by dying somehow. So we have... Where is our where is our win condition here? How do we win? Where am I going? Is this a spot? That looks pretty good. Can't Okay, I can mark it. Cool. So we have on our on our HUD where we're going. So if we want to traverse in a way that does not threaten us in any way, we should be going up top to that when he isn't watching. Is there anybody else who's gonna patrol around that area? There is. 
Looks like there's a ladder here. I could maybe use the ladder to get from top to top here. Is this, is this like workable? I'm trying to see. It doesn't look like we'd easily be able to climb up the edge of that. So I might have to go for the ladder. I could stasis him. Also, we should set off that bomb. Okay, no, it's already set. Cool. I was thinking it wouldn't be. That it would remember for that long. <laughs> Alright, can we drop? We can drop. Okay. There's one around me right now. I'm gonna stasis this one. Okay. Should be safe. Yep, oh, well, my friends have been called. And now we gotta do this the hard way. Oh god. Okay. <laughs> Interesting. <laughs> Did not think they would just gangbang me up top on the high ground, but apparently they can. <laughs> also means we have to take that spot by maybe killing that No, we can't kill the guy. We could try stealth killing him, but then he just still calls his dudes. We could freeze him. No, I think no. We we got on we got unlucky. We just have to try and go a little bit slower next time. So we use third person camera to go past this guy. That's easy enough. Look at that little knee shimmy. Do, 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 do. All right, we're not going to need the stasis this guy. That should trigger him. Really? Come on, man. You saw it the last time. <laughs> yeah, let me let me help you out. That better? <laughs> yes. Oh, he sees the banana. <laughs> it's cute. <laughs> He's got a different walk for when he sees bananas versus when he's scouting. Oh. I don't know why I thought B was jump. It's run. Alright, let's get our banana stock. And all this stuff again. Okay. So. Now that we've gotten back here, we need to figure out a way to not trigger out that guy last. He's below us. There's a guy below us. That's one I didn't know. There's gotta be a better way. There's two guys here. I think this, this is still the best way to drop. So now we just have to worry about this one. Let's watch this patrol. So he's gonna go around. Walk around that one rectangle it looks like. We have the one below us still. So we need to time it so that we go over him when this guy won't be hitting us. Also, those jumps though. <laughs> Holy crap, Ruby. It's not worth it, but <laughs> we could get it after the fact is the thing. Banana. Look at that banana. Alright. I think we can go now. 
This is about the same timing as we were before. Maybe I could shoot the banana? Go, go, go. Alright, we got it. <laughs> we have made it up. Our wind condition is over here. I remember. Is there a banana above him? No. But there could be. We could put one there. Okay. So here is our banana ambush. Let's find him. I think they're at the front. Yeah. Okay. Right there. Got him. Okay. Doesn't look like there's anybody in here. Wow. A replacement banana. Just what I wanted. <laughs> I believe this is a magnesis trick. One of these walls is fake. Yeah, there it is. Okay. Oh, we got this stuff first, because that just makes sense. Yep. Gimme, gimme. There's something over here, too. Oh, is this another duplex bow? God, we're getting so many. <laughs> duplex bows for days. Not getting rid of that. It's better than this, even though we haven't used it. I guess we'll get rid of the force bow. I'd like to keep something metal, just in case we have to go up and uh, do it. the uh, Death Mountain at any point. Am I doing this wrong way? What's, is this the other way? Door, please. Door. All right, so we have push. Do I have to, like, do it, from here? it always goes from here. Frog, why? Why do you do this? Turn door. Okay. <laughs> we figured it out. Eventually. Okay. And now we reach the easiest boss battle in the game. <laughs> this guy is a huge joke. But that's kind of the point. Hi. Who the heck are you? Wait a minute. Rub eyes that I can't rub. <laughs> that thing on your hip. Is that... Could it be the Sheikah Slate? If it's Sheikah Slate, then that means shock. It's you. You're that Link guy <laughs> I've been looking for. You just wander in. Yeah, I don't know about that. Oh, excuse me. Introduce myself. I am Master Kolga. The strong, the burly, the one, the only, Master Cole. Now prepare yourself. You know, he's gotten a lot fatter since Pokemon. <laughs> oh, we can't stasis? Nothing? Can I just, like, hit him? Cryo? Right, I guess we just hit him. Seems so kind of... What is the point of this? I can't stasis these. I can't magnesis these. I could bomb them, I guess. And I guess that's that. He's moving. Wowie, we figured it out. <laughs> He's got two. Oh, 
point. Okay. Well, I guess this just makes it easier, but it's not required. Drop the play. He's like, I'm spinning, but I'm totally safe. Nope. Cool. Not safe. <laughs> You're never safe with me. No, my club. I guess if we don't lose anything. You wanna do we wanna throw it? <laughs> wanna like yellow him? I wanna do it. Nice. It didn't didn't actually do what we needed to do, but you know, it was fun. Uh what else is close to breaking? I don't wanna use edge. I guess we'll use the scimitar. That's fine. I wonder if the reason they give you so many bows is specifically for this encounter. I think I missed it again. Oh no, we got him. It's a pretty generous hit. Whoa. Alright, buddy. That's metal. <laughs> No, the force field. Did you just do it again? Okay. <laughs> You're not very smart, friend. Who would have thought I'd be done in like this? And by this guy, of all people. I think I'm just gonna let this stand, do you? <laughs> oh, I was like, temper there. Oh, God. Pain. Can't go out this way. What to do? I got it. <laughs> I'll just make an even stronger attack. <laughs> an attack so strong will blow your horses. Briss has some serious moves, yes. Secret technique. Taught by my father's mother's father. Okay, let's let's think about this. Father's mother's father. How deep is that? So his dad's his grandmom, okay, so got his grandmom. His great grand dad his great granddad you could have just said that <laughs> okay here it comes it's so huge i'm so impressed wow just a, a bit big i will be gone and not just from my line of sight only the Yiga leader can use its ultimate. <laughs> you never, never really got any chance then, huh? <laughs> That's the only time you face him. So, kind of an awkward end there. Right, give me that thunder home back. Thank you. And now we can leave. Yes. Yeah, we, we are on top. We have done what we needed to do. We only died one time. That was pretty good. Unfortunately, if you try and go after him, this is a bottomless pit. So we're not going to do that. We're just going to return the goods. And then I think we'll probably end the stream after that. It's looking like it's getting to the end. Oh, one, one, uh, one thing <laughs> I guess to talk about before. The Overwatch League finals are going to be in Philadelphia this year. And as it turns out, I'm a Pennsylvania resident, so we might actually be able to go there. I don't know if I... Oh, my... I lost a weapon. That's right. I don't know if I'll be able to uh, stream it because I have no idea how to do any of that. But at the very least, I'd like to visit for my own benefit. That'd be fun. Excuse me, ladies. Passing through. Nothing to see here. <laughs> Just a man. Oh, yeah. Ah. 
I have a secret shop back here, but it's only open at the night and members only. I don't remember what the password is either. Oh, there's the flint quest that we need to activate, huh? That's the hotel. Where is the flint? Is it here? Yeah, you're the one. Ten flint. This is very worth it, because it gives you more equipment. Here's some flint. Bam. Okay, we don't have enough. So that'll have to happen at some point. Look at that meat. Holy crap. <laughs> it's making me hungry. Alright. Let's get that quest done. Oh, she's up top. One of my favorite dialogues here. Oh. You got permission to enter the chief's bedroom? Who are you? I don't know. do have a huge thumbs up for that design of her character. She looks really good. <laughs> How do I look? Hmm. Let me just gaze into your eyes and then think about a time of long, long lost memory. <laughs> Shouldn't look at a girl for that long, Link. She's gonna start insinuating things. <laughs> ah, well, you certainly got here fast. I should have expected as much from the princess's own appointed knight. She was out on a survey all day today. Still as the sands now. So, spill it, boy. Have the two of you been getting along all right? <laughs> it's okay, I know. Your silence speaks volumes. <laughs> she gets frustrated every time she looks up and sees you carrying that sword on your back. It makes her feel like a failure when it comes to her own destiny. Don't worry, it's not like you carry blame in any of this. It's unfortunate. She's put in more than enough time. Ever since she was a young girl, she's gone through rigorous daily routines to show her dedication. She once passed out in the freezing waters trying to access this healing power. And she has nothing to show for it. That's the motivation driving her research. I'd be doing the same thing. She really is quite special. You be sure to protect her with your life. It's quite the honor. The night brings a chill. It's probably time we take her in. Hmm. Or... Not very nice. <laughs> what was that? Did you feel that? Wait, what? How did you? What are you doing here? <laughs> What's so funny? <laughs> oh boy, it's a mean prank if I've ever seen one. <laughs> So are we honest or do we say it actually looks good? 
when I was in my playthrough, I said it was a tad big. I'm gonna say it again. <laughs> yeah, it's a little big. You know what I'm saying? I think she says you don't say regardless. So, no new dialogue. <laughs> but, I feel like it fits the character more. That one. <laughs> She'll grow into it. It's fine. Also, we're allowed in here now, I guess. There's nothing actually in here but the diary. And the diary is pretty lengthy from what I remember. Where is her diary? I know she has one. Maybe it's not... Oh, no, there it is. Okay. Yeah, it's like... We're not going to go through that, but... Diary here. Very worth reading. <laughs> uh, at least for lore, if you're into that. So that basically puts us at the end of the stream. I guess we can get up there. But, uh... I'm gonna have to think about preparing for that. Is there a pot anywhere? I might do that now. Usually there's a pot somewhere in this place. Plants wild berries later. I don't remember what triggers the quest though. This is just a room. Dang, I thought it was a shortcut. Oh well. Mm, well, I have never been in here. Holy crap. <laughs> really? What is this? Sure. <laughs> I'm only taking her fresh. So she's an expert. Good to know. <laughs> she knows about the Vaux and the Va. Or the Va. I don't know. It's a Vaux. I speak the language minimally. Where in God's name is this pot? There has to be a pot somewhere. There's always a pot somewhere. Don't lie to me, game. I know you haven't. Where is a pot? This kid's looking at rock salt like it's the most interesting thing in the world. <laughs> rock salt! Oh my god! <laughs> I gotta have that. I gotta buy that. You could literally just walk outside and break a rock apart and get that, buddy. We could, like, walk across the beach and find more interesting things like crabs. Uh, oh, actually, that's a chest. May I take the chest? Yes. Yoink. Right now. Well, that is not worth it. We'll keep that there. You know. Ah. Oh. <laughs> okay. 
this is Sand Seal Rental. This is Guard. Well, there is no place to cook food around here, so I guess we're just kind of stuck. Unless we warp. And that's gonna probably put us into a huge sidetrack, so rather than warp and completely lose myself in the moment, I guess we're gonna call it here. Yeah, I, I can't think of anything else. So we're going to call it for here today. Next stream, we will go and kill that divine beast and everything inside it, as we usually do. Um, there's no need to mark, right? Yeah, they have the they have the quest marker there. Then after that, I guess if we don't already have the master sword, we'll get the master sword. And I might just wander. I feel like we 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 want to wander around a little bit. <laughs> My poor horse, all the way up here alone. I'm sorry. <laughs> we should probably get the uh, the upgraded horse quests done. So I'll, I want to go here at some point to get that. And I I think there's another one for the white horse. So I don't quite remember to get that. If, but if not, we can just get the black horse and be done with it. Uh, and then we could get some upgraded gear from here. Yep. Yeah. Okay. Anyways, that is it for me today. Monday. I guess we'll do the rest of Overwatch placements. I don't know when the new skins release but i want to do overwatch then so whenever the the new skins for overwatch league release we're going to do that and then we'll do the rest of the placements then and then monday pending will be either hearthstone or Overwatch, depending on on that timing um and then i'll do like hearthstone on the other day and then we can do hearthstone wednesday some other game on thursday or hearthstone thursday and then this again on Friday, as usual. But that is it for me today. I will see you Monday.